Hello and welcome to MBKM Models. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and follow for more great aircraft documentaries and model build videos. The Blackburn B-101 Beverly was a heavy transport aircraft produced by the British aircraft manufacturer Blackburn Aircraft. It was notably the only land-based transport airplane built by Blackburn, a company that otherwise specialised in producing naval fighter aircraft. The Beverly was originally designed by General Aircraft as the GAL. 60 Universal Freighter reflecting its intended use by both military and civil operators. The design process had started during the Second World War and drew upon the General Aircraft Hamel Car Glider. A major design study was conducted in 1945 ahead of specification C346 being released by the Air Ministry. The company's proposal was accepted and the Air Ministry placed an order for one prototype. General Aircraft was absorbed by Blackburn during the late 1940s who continued the project. On the 20th of June 1950, the first prototype conducted its maiden flight from the company's Bruff facility. It was Britain's second largest land plane at the time of flight. The Ministry of Supply mandated specification changes during the flight test programme, which necessitated a second prototype be constructed to a modified design. On the 1st of October 1952, an initial order for 20 aircraft was placed on behalf of the Royal Air Force. On the 12th of March 1956, the first production Beverly C-1 was delivered to No. 47 Squadron, stationed at RAF Abingdon. Between 1956 and 1967, the Beverly would be flown by six squadrons of the Royal Air Force Transport Command. With the RAF, the Beverly would be deployed to various corners of the globe, including Kenya, Bahrain and Vietnam. Despite ambitions to secure commercial customers for the type, Blackburn were unable to garner orders beyond those placed by the RAF. The final operational Beverly was withdrawn from RAF service during August 1967. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and until next time.